It's time to play the music. It's time to light the lights. It's time to meet the Muppets on the Muppet Show tonight. Ready? No. Hello! Welcome to one of my favorite activities that I can only bully my husband into doing maybe once a year. Sometimes. No, I would say once a year. We did it. The last time we did this was at the apartment. And it is going through Phoebe's closet, and, and the editor will put it in really sparkly letters above me. It's Phoebe's favorite activity. The difference in this one compared to other ones is some of them will be plus size, so I'm going to put those in the basket to go to our plus size clothing swap. But the ones that are not plus size, I'm just putting on the chair, and we'll just donate them to a thrift store. Um, something else is that Phoebe hates this a lot. So they're, no. <laughs> they are going to get, no, I love it. We are going to get fun dinner afterwards. We'll also go through my closet. I don't know if this will be interesting. We're also not trying every piece on. No, I the, would die. I would say the thesis of this video is it's okay. If your body changes, it's okay. If your style changes, what is not okay for your mental health is to have a closet full of clothes that you don't like or that don't fit you. You deserve to have a closet of nice things that you like. I'm hearing that. So Phoebe probably won't try on most things because I think they'll know. But some things we might have a little fashion show. Also, we haven't cleaned our house, okay? That's real life. Yeah. 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 So don't judge us. Yeah. Because there's stuff everywhere. Right now, the clothes that Phoebe likes the most end up on the floor because there's no room in the closet. Yeah. All right. I think first we should start with this box. Ah, you can't go through that. Sorry, sorry. You can't. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I knew you would never touch it, so there's a present for you in there. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to scare you. I got scared. You can't go through that. Okay, well, you have to go through it, though. Okay. All right. Okay. I guess we won't start with the box. Sorry, I'm sorry. I think we start with these overalls I've seen you wear twice. Yeah, I will not wear those. And then what size are they? They're 16. Are they? Yeah, so we can take them to the swap. Okay. They are inside out. Sometimes that happens. Which I do think is interesting. That's not a crime. I mean, they're cute. Someone will either... I don't think they'll fit me. I think I'm an 18 now, legally. Do you want to try them on? I would guess. you wear them even if they fit? I would. might wear them as shorts. Go try them on. Okay. You could step behind That's our what I'll camera. Be doing. Thank you. Okay, you keep talking to me. Go all ahead. right, all right, all right. I'm sick of those. Perfect. I, I think these are I'll universal look standard. Look they are, yeah. I think they're technically just like a large though. I do too. They might even be less than that. Yeah, I think they're small, yeah. I'm gonna take these to the regular thrift store. These are black, I think also Old Navy. Oh no, these are also Universal Standard. Um, I already have black overall shorts, so I would say no. All right. It's important to be honest with yourself. Yes, I know. I don't know, do you think if I cut these, the legs off of these, would I wear them? I don't know. Let me see you. I don't love how they fit in my tummy. If you don't, then we don't need, there's no reason to keep them. If you want more, we can go get more from Old Navy in a bigger size. Okay. <laughs> it seems like, okay, how do you feel about these? You really like them when you got them. Can I try those on again? Yeah. I think that they're a little bit weird in my, like, breastular area. Thank you. Okay, these are just donations. <laughs> no, I think they're 16, so they can These go ones say Morden Miss. Yeah. Because they're supposed to be Modern Miss. Yeah. No, Morden Miss is cute. Morden Miss is incredible. I don't know what you're talking about. How you looking over there? I think it's just, it's like impossible to wear. Okay, I look absurd. <laughs> Show them your toddler fit. I look like a tube, but negative. I, no, but you like to I normally. can't close this. Then let's, let's take them to the swap. No, let's just because I can't reach it. Yeah. I did get them from the swap. So we'll take them back. Yeah. Okay, how do you feel about this? I know you liked it when you got it, but you've worn it only once. But it is kind of a fancy... I would love to wear it when I have top surgery. That is my problem. Oh, that's fine. And that's I think easy. that it's okay. To You've keep got it. room to keep it. Yeah. I do really love it. I feel like it's too breast focused. I'm, don't you dare get rid of that. I'm not getting rid of anything. I'm obsessed with it. 
I also think it'd be nice if we kind of separated these by, by what they yeah, are. Yeah, sometimes it's just a different season. Okay, here we have Connect for Xbox 360. Okay, that's hilarious, Morgan. Do you wear this shirt? I'm going to cut it in half with another shirt. So you want to put it, you want to keep it in the closet or you want to put it in a project pile? What size is it? It's a large, I think. Yeah, it's a, a men's large. We can get rid of it. I don't think you'll wear it. Okay. But, I mean, I still love you, though, even though you won't wear it. You don't. You hate me. No. All right. You're doing so good. Okay, we have HP. That one I do want. What size is it? Extra large. Yes. All right. Thank you. Our flag means death. Yeah. I'm keeping it. I really like that tank top also. Okay. These are pants, which is insane. Oh, are those my Lucien Yaks? Yeah. Those are like my favorite, like, Okay, dark... I'm going to put them down here with pants. Okay. Which we'll get to more in a minute. Yeah. Your juicy shirt you wear a lot. Yeah. Why are you sad? I love it. I wish it was, like, one size bigger. I might Frankenstein wanna... it at some okay. point. Okay. All right. Actually, it, once I have top surgery, it might be fine. But right now, it's just a little bit too... I'm going to leave it here with shirts, and I'll move those. Quit your witches. I'm obsessed with that shirt. Phoebe loves this shirt. It's one of my favorite shirts. Which is hilarious because it's insane. Yeah. This shirt is not fashionable. It doesn't and matter. And you love it. I don't wear it for fashion. You don't wear it for fashion. I wear it because it's iconic. It's so funny how much you love it. And but I'm your happy that you is it. hilarious. That's, that's a... That's okay. A, now, while you only wear this on vacation, I, I don't think it. you can ever get rid of it. Yeah, no, it's my fave. It's a swimsuit cover. Up. We'll put it over here with special. Okay. All right. Post office shirt. I actually would like that out so that I can dye it purple because I think that'll fix the America problem. Okay, we it. can leave it out. Because post office shirt is hilarious, but I don't want people it to looks, think I'm a Republican. Yeah, it looks like you love the like America. Yeah, but it's closer you, to them so they can see. It's if literally, you look, it's just about stamps. It's literally about, it's so funny. It's a shirt about stamps. Which is fun. They said stamps rights. Yeah. All right, pink shirt. Now, I love pink shirt. Put it, hand it to me. It's an extra large. Is it an extra large? Yeah. Maybe I've been sleeping on this one. I mean, it is hot right now, so. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's good. That's a good shirt. It is a good shirt. You never wear it. I'm, it's hot. It's hot out. Okay, big peach. Fishing shirt. This is for fishers. For fishermen. I'd like that one to go away. It's okay. What size is it? It's just a I large. It's just a large, yeah. All right, pink shirt. You'll notice a theme here. What size is that one? Extra large. I want that. I want to cut it into a crop top and then cut it in half with another one. Now, I do wear that in the winter. As I think like that's a fair. I one. think that's fair. I'm not arguing with you. It's not my favorite article of clothing, but it is very functional. I think I'm going to leave everything where it is, and then I can do a time lapse of me putting things in order. Okay. Obsessed with that, don't you dare. It's incredible. Yeah. It's a year-round sweater. I'm showing everyone. Sweater. Okay. It's not a year-round sweater. Uh, it is. But it is. Winnie the Pooh is all nice seasons. Not just Christmas. I don't wear these. No. Do they even? Really oh, they good. would fit you. Yeah. They're gray, and they're Levi's. But you don't you don't reach for them. Can we put that one in like a maybe? Can we put that in a revisiting? Because I also don't think it's very fair because pants right now it's too hot for pants. And I don't think it's a bad idea to have things that fit me well that I'm comfortable in. But they don't spark joy. But I don't have to buy new pants. I'm obsessed with that. I just I need to have top surgery. That's a top surgery. It's a twenty. Huh? It's a two X. Yeah. It's really cute. I do like this one. It's one of the Mike Bennett shirts. It's really cute. Yeah, it is really cute. I'm not arguing. I'm not wearing it all the time, but that is for special occasions. Yeah, I think this is a special occasion. I think I'm wearing shirt. that to the wedding. I think that makes sense. I like that green t-shirt. This is... I like it. I'm allowed to like it. That is fine. I'm sorry. It is funny. It's just a green t-shirt. I like it. It's comfortable. My dad gave it to me. She's so mean. Now, 
Um, it's this is iconic. Classic. Absolutely. Yeah. If I was to get rid of that, I'd have to sell it for eight thousand dollars. One of my favorite pairs of pants. We're keeping them. Lucy and Yak literally owns my lower half. Yeah. Sorry. This is the shirt we just bought. Oh yeah. Yeah. yeah but yeah. it's cute. Well, and that one's a weave share it. Yeah. So if you'd like to keep it in your closet for now, that's okay. I did just wear it. Important. This is one Phoebe just got. A also. classic. I think something else that's really funny is Phoebe and I are opposites in a lot of ways. And one of them is that I hang as few of my clothes as possible. Because I feel like it takes very little energy to fold them and put them away. If I can't see my clothes, they don't exist. So like that drawer, I wish it didn't exist. It's a very pretty dresser drawer. The hoodie isn't fair because it's been so hot. <laughs> no, I'm not. Do you think I'm trying to get you to get rid of things that are cool? Yes. No. Mike Bennett, this is another Mike Bennett piece. It's incredible. Piece. Mike Bennett's very talented. Yeah. It's a Rat King. This is your... Oh, this is a mix, <clears throat> mix apparel That's shirt. That's my favorite shirt. Yeah. This is a good one. Mix apparel makes, uh, like... Gender inclusive. Thank you. I was trying to say, like... It's like gender non-conforming, gender inclusive clothing. That is my favorite t-shirt in the world. It's the only t-shirt I have that's not oversized that fits me in a way that I like. Yeah. Those pants from Universal Standard I'm obsessed with. Okay. Sometimes we get things in brand deals and I'm like, this is so cute for someone else. And then other times we get things where I'm like, that I'm obsessed with. These are another Lucy and Yak pair. Yes, I really love those. They're going to be excellent for the fall. <laughs> I'm sensing a theme here. This is your Jake Wesley Rogers shirt. It's incredible. Yeah. I'm keeping it. That's fine. And then your big... Yeah. Hang on, I'll show them. I like it for layering. This one was actually inspired by a brand deal that we did because we got a shirt from uh, so Universal we, Standard think, that was yeah. supposed to be like a women's tunic. It was, yeah, it was clearly supposed to be for layering in the way that Phoebe uses this one. Yes, but it was, it was very fun. it was very breast focused, which is a crime against me. Okay, I'm going two now. I love both of those. All right, that's my TikTok shirt and my pink shirt. It's not red; it's pink. Okay, obviously keeping Sarah Day. The flowers, <laughs> I love them. You can keep them. You just I have never seen you wear them. I know it's not comfortable. It's an anti autism shirt. That's fine. Let's get rid of it, and someone will like it. Okay. It's only a large. Some of these things I think we could depop. We won't, though. That's true. We don't have time for another job. You're right. We will give them to our local thrift store. Okay. Yeah, that's my favorite sweater. This is a Phoebe. Phoebe stole this. Phoebe's a thief, and they stole it from their theater department, and now they wear it super often. It's yes. one of their cartoon outfits. Sorry to Beth Bentley. It's incredible, and I'm keeping it. <laughs> That one, when I bought it at a thrift store, I didn't think I was going to wear it ever because it's red. I wanted to be wearing that. Do, but do you, it's a medium, number one. Is it a medium? It's a medium. T and touch it. There's a reason you don't grab it for it. Okay. Tell him goodbye. Goodbye. Goodbye, Mr. Creamsicle Harry Styles sweater. Well, and when you wear it, you're all one color. That's true. Did you want to tell them about this one? This is a, it's a flannel for trainees. It's a trannel. <laughs> it. It's really good. This is more trans positive clothing. I'm obsessed with this shirt. It's really good. I'll be keeping that. I don't I'm know not, where that's from. I don't want that. I've never seen you wear this one. I think it's from my dad just now. And I was like, maybe I'll wear that. He was going through his closet. Yeah. As you should. It's because we went and finally did the garage where he had a bunch of clothes he forgot about. Oh, love Kirkland. Yeah. Important. That's a good one. It's a good one. This is important for other hotter times. What size is it? It's an extra large. I've worn it before. I know you've worn it before. I know how it fits. Miss Naughty Woman. No, I believe you. That's my other favorite sweater. <laughs> This one we got at uh, Furbish. Furbish in Salem. It is really cute. It's so cute. It's so hot. It is, yeah. Well, it's cozy. It's good for it to be cozy. What is this? This is a Worthington Women's 3X. Oh, oh was this for goth prom? Yeah, it was for goth prom. Are you going to wear it again? Touch it. We spent like $7 I on know, it. I know, we can get rid of it. It we served its purpose for us, which was for a photo. It did. It did. 
And it's a 3x, so we can take it to the swap. Yeah. Oh, were those also from that? I no, think so. these are my free label pants. Mm, yes, they are. Do you want to touch them? They're not, they're, they're good. I like the feel of them. You just don't wear a lot of black? I don't know if it's even really that. It's like the way that they fit is like business casual. Mm -hmm. And I'm only ever casual. You know? Yeah, we could take it to the swap. Okay. They're an XL. So they'll get, they'll get loved. I'd rather someone love them. Yeah. But we love free label. I'm yeah, wearing a bra from them right now yeah. that I literally. They're not going to know. Off. No. That you don't wear the shirt that they gave you. Okay. This hurts my heart. <laughs> Cause of the way it fits. No, if it's really good. I, I, I love it. I, I would like to see if I will wear it in the fall. It's absurd. It's, it's a really, Noah's art. It is really fun. Embroidery. It's unhinged. It's also really cute with the trannel. So, write that down. Okay. This is another... Yes, I'd like to keep that one because it's a different vibe. All right. Oh, my God. I think of the Honey's Blowtorch shirts, which I love very much, I think I should keep that one or the other one and not both of them because I don't reach for them as no. often as I would like to. No, I mean, they are nice for ads because they don't have any brands on them. Yeah. We could bring one of them to the clothing swap, though. Which one? I think the I think this one is the one that we should get rid of because it's got navy in it. And then the orange one, I do wear more consistently. That's true. <gasps> I forgot that exists. Yay, keep it. Mickey Cruz. It's so good. It is really good. At the time that we went on our honeymoon, we made a mask that matched it. Yeah. We can hand that over to someone. And I love him. I know. And when you used to wear him, he was cute, but you don't wear him anymore. No. I'm not physically able to get rid of this. <laughs> Do you want to talk about it? It's a, it's a weird vintage Epcot shirt. It is, but it's like a size small, I think. I have, it's none of your business what size it is. <laughs> and it's also none of mine. What is it? It's, it says it's an XL, but it, it is literally from 1982. I'm, I'm holding on to that. That's right. fine. You are allowed to. You can keep as much as you want. I just don't, it won't help you to keep things you're not wearing. Oh, this one's so cool. It is really fun. It is an extra large. Men's extra large, though. Let's get rid of that other pink one, and I'll keep this one. The plain pink? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because this is a really good one. It's got fun colors. Blocky. I'm obsessed with this shirt. I'm keeping it. That one I don't wear as much. These are by the same artist that Phoebe, we, we were gifted these, Phoebe bought these. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They're like $80 each and they love this artist. Yeah. They're better days on Instagram, they're lovely. That one I think is just like the tiniest but too small on me. Let's take it to the swap. I think it is like an XL. Yeah. And I think some other gay person will love it. Yeah. It's a two piece. It's incredible. It's so cool. It's so cool. If you won't wear it, we can take it to the swap. If you think you might wear it like on the next cruise, like it's a very cruise fit. I would like to hold on to it for that reason. I think that's fine. And know that it's just not something that I'll wear often. This is your Disney Wonder Spirit jersey. Keeping it. Disney Wonder. Disney Wonder. We can get rid of that. It's. It's cute. It bumps me out. I think it is from the juniors part of Target. Yeah, absolutely. It might it's be a large. large. Yeah, that makes sense. And it was really, you wore it a lot that year. That's mine. It's good. It is cool. It's a little funky windbreaker. So good. This is my absurd Alabama shirt. <laughs> Feel it. Let me put it on. It is very plasticky. It's not. It's it's a little bit silky. Now you are so cute in it. I know. And it's like very light. 
Ah, fuck. There's a button over my breast. It would need to be like a tie-up situation or not. No, I do think it's really cute, especially with your shorts. Let me see. How do you feel? I feel cutesy. I think it's really cute. Butch crop top summer. Yeah, I can't, it won't, because of my apple shape, which is not a crime, I don't think it buttons like comfortably down. No, but you would never wear a button. You would never button that shirt all the way down like that. No, that's true. This I'm keeping and I'll wear it to Disneyland. With these shorts. It'd be a really cute picture in Adventureland. Yes. Yeah, that's the one that we bought for like $15 at a fucking Ron John. It was the one where they had all that like really obscene like Trump stuff. Not obscene as in like oh. naked, but like he was like holding the head of an elephant or yes. a donkey that was like bleeding. Yeah. Okay, I can't button this. Can you button this? The fact that the Democrats chose a donkey is absurd to me. They were like, we're setting you up for ass jokes. This is large yellow shirt. I won't wear it. It was from my dad. Nice. He's still alive. He just cleaned out his closet. <laughs> I love this shirt. It's a weird, fun shirt, and I love it. It is weird. It is fun. It is very peepy. -pee. Yeah. I couldn't begin to tell you what it is about this little gray sweatshirt. I'm obsessed with it. I wear it all the you time. You do wear it a lot. It's Fat Babe Apparel. It's a great sweatshirt. It's, it's a just Golden 2X. I've never in my life liked a... Uh, like a heathered no gray i this anything. all the stuff is it gildan am i saying it right yeah all the stuff at gildan it's like so good it's like the comfort colors of sweatshirts yeah. well and everybody is a good body is a really good thing anyway. yeah so fat babe apparel buy that Ebb, perfect perfect shirt Ebb, perfect Ebb, perfect hey i found another free hanger oh so five yeah we can get rid of these you know which ones they are so many of yours look the same, I can't tell them apart. These are the best ones. Oh, I'm sorry. Well, they don't have a brand. Are you sure? Yeah. All right. Well, they're, they're an XL. They're the best ones. So some other queer person will love them. These are another pair of cargo shorts. Those pants are not Target, yeah. Wrangler. Yeah, we can get rid of those. This is the shirt you just made. Oh, it's wait. Incredible. Incredible. Okay. What are you doing? Why'd you push away those ones? Those are, you just got those. Did no, you? Oh, these are your, I'm confusing them with your Lucy hitting it. Yeah. These were so cool. And this was all you wore like last summer. Yeah. American Eagle, light wash cargo jeans. Yeah. But they're really cute. What size are they? The, they were the largest I think American Eagle had. They were 14. Yeah, there's no fucking way. Should we see if Bo wants them? Oh, sure. Bo might want them. I guess I'll put them with this. Okay, these pants are so fucking cool, and they're made by Mix Apparel, and they're so fucking cool. It's not a style that I wear. No, these are very, like, punk? Yes. Is it punk? I don't it's, it's looking kind of punk. It's looking kind of punk. Um, I can't tell. Someone at the swap will like them. Yeah, they'll be stoked. Okay, and then those are all the pants we just put down there. Yeah. All right. We're, we're almost halfway done. This is the shirt you just made. Yes. Incredible. Baby, put it together. I see you put a button in the back. Uh, well, yeah, it's to hold down the collar. Oh, okay. Cute. Well, I could have just, like, tacked it down, but I thought it'd be cuter with a button. This is the one you'd like to keep. Yes. It fucks. It's just long sleepy hot times. That's fine. I Believe can, in yourself. I will not be getting rid of this shirt. Because <laughs> I have to wear it on the plane. Why? That's my shirt to wear on the plane. I don't think this is a plane shirt. It is. It says believe in yourself. Let me be a little whore. I love it. You are weird. Okay, this is just a turtleneck? Oh, it's the free label one. It's really good. Yeah. Oh. That's like the best turtleneck I own. 
And I have one in heather gray, one in navy, and one in black. I'm so sick of that thing. I'm never going to wear that. We'll take it to the swap. Yeah. Someone will be like, why is there merch here? Sorry. Okay, this is our second big yellow, I think. Oh, yeah, that's a good one. The other yellow, that one's a comfortable, that one's a good texture. This is Cruise shirt. I love this shirt. Yeah. You never wear it. It's Cruise shirt. Well, sometimes you cruise at the house. It's for when I get wet. <laughs> what size are they? 18. They're the Boyfriend Universal Thread. Oh, okay. Target. I, I will keep those. I won't wear them much because they're khaki. Well, they're nice for... You could wear these to the wedding. No. No, I'm excited about those weird drawstring pants. Yeah, I'll get rid of that. Yeah, it's only a large. It seems like if you have to think this hard, you don't love either of them. Yeah. Now, I love this shirt. If I'm gonna keep a terry cloth one, I'd rather keep that one. This one? Yeah. You wanna get rid of the purple one? Yeah. But I'm sad about it. Well, you, I mean, you have room to keep both of them. Okay, let's keep both of them for now. That is a really good shirt. Oh, that's what I should wear to the wedding with those pants. Oh, you're right. That'd be really cute. I love the lesbian shirt from Target. This is from Target? Target lesbian it shirt. It wasn't on purpose lesbian, I don't think. No. Now, if you want to get rid of this one, it's okay. No, no. You I, never wear it. Uh, it's a good shirt. It's okay. Are you, it's not okay. It was $12. Okay. I think we can get rid of it. Someone at the swap will think it's really funny. They will. It's super cute. I got it for Phoebe for Christmas yeah. last year. You're so funny, girl. You love possums and you love tootin'. I know. That's true. I love both of those. Sorry. Sorry to that man. <laughs> I love them. I don't have the emotional word of all to deal with this. Let me try it on. Baby, it's uncomfortable and there's no pockets. If you want a singlet, we can get one from Old Navy that has pockets. Do they have singlets with pockets now? I think so. Well, they have the bike shorts with pockets at Old Navy. Now those on the other side of the camera cannot see. <laughs> Baby, it's like a medium that you bought four years ago. It's a large. In 2019. It's okay. And you wore it a lot and it has served its purpose. And someone at the thrift store will be really excited to get it. We can get you an, I'm wearing a singlet right now. You just can't tell. This one has a hood, a it's, surprise hood. It's so weird and cool. Let's take it back to the clothing swap because I really haven't worn it like at all. Yeah. But it's good. It is really cool. It's not that it's not good. I'm trying to decide if I want that to be the one that I cut in half with the pink one. This one's a large. Oh, we'll get rid of it then. But I'm sad. One of these days, and I don't know when, I'm just going to upcycle that one onto a sweatshirt that actually fits me again. Oh, I think that's a great idea. But it is, that is my all-time favorite article of clothing that's ever lived. This is incredible and I'm keeping this is, I think what's really funny about this, this was on our honeymoon. Yeah. Is, uh. Let me try it on to make sure it fits my breasts okay. I think it was Shelly and I, or maybe Hannah and I. Yeah, um, it was you and Hannah. Are making fun of that shirt. And being like, why would they make a denim spirit jersey hoodie? That's like, it's like so, you can hear Phoebe putting it on. It's so like crunchy. And then Phoebe late, like 10 minutes later is like, I found the coolest chambray shirt. It's so cool. <laughs> I'm glad you love it. 
What's even funnier is that our friend Jacob went to Disneyland like a year later and bought the Disneyland version. Yeah. Are you keeping it? I will be cropping it. All right. Put in your project file. Oh my god. We have Jesus was a communist. Important. Keeping it. The Bell's pants. I fuck with them. Oh yeah. I forgot you got them at Bell's. A good shirt that dad got me. You want it hung or you want it folded? Hung. Okay. I got a hanger. <laughs> Go ahead. Yes. You just got this one. Hung. That's a good one. Here, I'll give you a little pile. I'll put it behind you. These Phoebe just made into Capri. Well, I made them into Capri's. Yes. I've sewed them. I love them. Nothing, you're so cutesy, boy. You're mean, mean, mean girl. Yeah, that's one of my favorite shirts. This we got for a dollar. No, it was three dollars. No, what? I was excited. Oh, gotcha. No, it was a dollar. My shirt was three dollars. No. It was at Old Navy. They were having like a crazy good sale. Yeah, it was bonkers. Probably because they overproduced. But yeah. in this case, Phoebe lucked out. These are the pants you want to wear to the wedding. Yes. Baby got these at the swap? Yes. They're from Eloquy. They're really fun. Yeah. They're like paper bag pants. Yes. They're like, it's hard to tell, I'm sure, in the video, but they're like slacks material. Yeah. They're fancy. This is from St. Airbrush. Yeah, we bought it. Brushes. We were not gifted it. No. And it is really cute. Sorry, I'm not trying to overwhelm you. Hold me. on, hold on. Take my things from no. me. There you go. Why'd you hand the, hang the fancy pants different than all, every other pair of pants? What? I hung them the same way that I hung the other pair of pants in there. I don't normally have the, the, the slatsies. All right. Okay. You're throwing me off here, May. No. I'm hanging these up like this for now. All right. Okay. And they, they don't really fit, so. Okay, be careful. This my snap shirt. This is a banana shirt. It's incredible. And you're a wench. Phoebe just bought it. These also, now they just look like this because we just air dried them. Yeah, we'll throw them back in the dryer. But they're from Future Collective. Yeah. They're really fun. What are you doing over there? Oh, you said you want to throw them back in the dryer. Oh, yeah, that's true. I thought you were trying to take them from me. Yes. It's a sweater vest you just got. Yeah, I think I'm going to dye it. What's it made out of? Cashmere alone. Oh, acrylic? I have to get rid of that. That's okay. I think it's only a large anyway. It's got a weird stain. Oh, it's a nice bell. Well, then I'll take it to the regular thrift store. Oh, yes. I love this. Just got that. From the women's section of... Tar I mean, Walmart. Walmart. They're selling Ken Fitz. Yes. Coochie Gucci. Coochie. Incredible. Oh, my God. I'm over. No, no, no. Now, this is your Barbie fit. Yeah. Except you don't want to be this Barbie anymore. Yeah. That's okay. We spent like $4 on it. That's true. I love that one. Now, this is what Phoebe wears when they want to be a slut with their little arms out. Okay. Swap me. I handed it to you normal. I'll see that. They hang up really good. Yeah. Mom just gave you this because it was left over, right? No, it's from the clothing swap. Will you wear it? No. Will Hannah wear it? Or Mom, maybe. We can ask them. But nobody took it at the clothing swap, which I was shocked by. I think it's because it's only like an XL. Yeah, yeah. I love that one. Oh, that's for the bathroom. I'm a sage green era. Yes, and I love it. <laughs> you can get rid of plain gray t-shirts. But you kept plain green t-shirts? Yeah. Well, I don't understand green. your rules. Okay. 
<gasps> yes, the best. Incredible. Oh, these are Phoebe's cover union overalls. They're amazing. You need some more? Um, yeah. Can you hand me? Yeah, I just need one that has an indent in it. Okay, now, is your plan to hang shorts? I think, um, yes, unfortunately. <laughs> okay. But I'll take the belt off of that. Okay, there you go. I do want those. Okay, you figure that out. Oh, yeah, yeah. It's good. Well, you haven't hung it up, so I thought you didn't want it anymore. Oh, what? No, it's really cute. Did you feel how heavy it is? Yeah. It's like fucking dense, which is great, but it's hot outside. Oh, my God. <laughs> yes. Did you try them on? Recently? Yeah. Um, I mean, when we went on the cruise. But they were oversized. Oh, you're right. They were, they were, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That should be fine. They're 20s. Yeah. Oh, they yeah. They should be more than fine. I thought so, yeah. Well, yeah. Sorry. I wasn't judging you. I didn't want you no, to be no, sad no. later. No, that's okay. That's fair. If we didn't just deal with them now. Does that make sense? Yeah. No, I'm fairly certain those are going to fit me. Okay. So you're right there, buddy. Those are my little, little, little tiny shorts. <laughs> Her pajamas sometimes. I was just wearing those earlier. All right, I'm switching to your dresser. Uh, this will actually be quicker because I think we have like a fully empty drawer almost. I don't think so. Okay, this is a keep. You're keeping these. And your Robert Pattinson shirt. Now, I won't make you go through the top one. Thank you. Because it's mostly underwear. Yeah. Okay, what about these bad boys? Uh, ah, shit. There's one pair of the cargo shorts that's really good and another that's not as good. They're hanging up behind you. Okay, I'll try those both on. But these, not right now because I'll scream. These are your shorts. Your bike shorts. Okay. We have to get rid of Silky Husband. I know. We can get you a new Silky Husband. Okay. I'm exhausted of this process. I have to get rid of those. They don't tell me they hurt my body. This I can get rid of. <laughs> this I can get rid of. These I want. Oh, okay. Perfect. I don't even know what this is. Oh, it's a weird tank top. We can get rid of that. This is just a gray shirt. Okay, I get it out of there. I don't know. Him. <laughs> is someone sneaking things into here in the night? Yes. In the dark? I don't have time to emotionally deal with that. That's okay. I'm keeping mine and it doesn't really fit. Okay. Maybe I'll Frankenstein it eventually. We can get rid of that one. We can take it to the swap, I think. Yeah. Sure. Swants. These are Phoebe's swants. <laughs> They're my swim pants. They're swim pants. They're bananas. They're incredible. Yes. These are really cute. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Pink? Yes. I know it's silly that we have so many swimsuits when we live in Oregon, but we do have a hot tub at our house. Yeah. And we have friends at complexes that have pools. Magic King, I'm sure. What? I thought you were keeping it. It's not, no, I don't think I will. That's okay. It's not from any, it's just. It was literally secret. a thrift store on the yeah. floor, We can get rid of that one. Yeah. And it's a shirt we got for free, but it's nice. What size is that? This is from our honeymoon. It's a large, but you have time to Frankenstein it before we go to Disneyland. Yeah. 
I'm keeping that. For a project? Yeah. It was super easy to do. Mm-hmm. Oh, that I love. It's a good one. <laughs> one thing about Phoebe, if you give them a purple Halloween themed shirt. Now, I know you're not getting rid of those, but. No. It Ooh. is funny. Thank you. Figment Girl Watcher. It's really good. It's you, really good. It's so sticky. You never wear it. It's so sticky. Yeah. Is that like, your phone going off? I have mine? no idea, girl. It pop. How would I know that? I hope it's still filming. Did you check? If it's still filming? Yeah. Oh, my God. Yes. Okay, good. This is 42 minutes. And it'll only be one file. Put that back. <laughs> Do you see how, like, not very filled these are, though? Like, it really won't take long. Look at me dying. No, no, no. Hey, why are these in here? Are they in trouble? No. I've been looking for those. <laughs> I didn't put them in the drawer. I think you did. No, no, no. Okay. I'm wilting. No, no, no. You're so close. I love them. You want to keep these? Yes. Why don't you like <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Finger. No, no. I just haven't seen you wear them in a really long time. Get rid of them. <laughs> Get them out of here. This is a tea towel. None of your business. Ah, oh, these I don't wear. They are good though. They are good. I forgot those existed. These definitely fit you. Yes. You want to hang them? Yeah. Oh my god, I'm dying. Booby shirt. We have to keep it. Last one. Ugh. Yes, I'm keeping. Love these. You see how many? You're always trying to get me to buy more swim shorts. Like I don't have eight <laughs> pairs. I know, but they're all so cute. Also, we're cruise people. We're creepy. These I'll are still wearing those, yeah. I'm wilting. You have to get rid of that one. I'll keep it. These are the ones we just got. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm keeping it. Those are Oh, those are Hannah's, actually. Oh, for when she stays in there? Yes. Put them with her little blue thing there. Yeah. Oh my god, I forgot about these. I completely forgot about these. I do think they'll still fit you. Um, but if you don't like them, you don't have to keep them. And you have lots of pairs of shorts. There's no need to keep them. Okay, let's get rid of them. You're so brave. Those I like. Okay, and then your Christmas jammies. Yeah, keep them. And then these. Yes. All right. That's it. That's it, and you're done. And you were very brave. You have to let me buy food now. All right, yeah, we can order, because I'm so hungry. That's the end of Phoebe's. We are taking a break for snack time. Yes. Aw. Did I mess it up? Yeah, it's okay. I got the two cheeseburger meal from McDonald's. I'm a McDonald's girly. Anytime we get fun dinner, I'll probably get McDonald's or Wendy's. Phoebe got Mod Pizza, and it'll get here in 10 minutes. I did. Well, I was supposed to get a teriyaki bowl from my favorite teriyaki place, but they're closed today. Yeah, hey, I guess they're closed on Mondays, maybe? As a crime against me, and I'm heartbroken. Yeah. But that's okay. We're watching some Lost. Yeah. All right. Pee May, what did you get? I got Mod Pizza. Ooh. It's garlic rub with uh, fake meat and fake cheese and balsamic glaze and olives. Beautiful. It's my favorite. And it's a little treat for being so brave. You're mean, girl. This is another godforsaken time lapse. This is a time lapse. My wife loves to time lapse because she is not the one who edits. It's a time lapse, time lapse. Sorry, go ahead. This is the tour. Okay. These are just t shirts. Speak up. These are t shirts. All right. Regular t shirts. Okay. They go here on the left. Sure. Also, like your sleepless, like tank. This is collared shirts. Okay. Which you use as t-shirts. Right. Then we get into long sleeves. This is just all the long sleeve shirts. Okay. Together. Then we have sweaters and jackets. 
Okay. Then we have, well, special occasion, but it's a very small area. It's like four <laughs> things. Okay. Then overalls. Makes sense. Pants and shorts. All right. Your dirty basket goes here. Mm-hmm. Your in-between basket, which I think you should clean out every two weeks, it can't just keep being a huge pile. Hmm. And these are all the things you get rid of. Hmm. That's really good. Thanks. Okay. Go team. Go team. Yay! Yay! Okay, now, I just built this closet a few weeks ago, so I actually already went through my closet clothes very recently. But, hey, I have two dressers, because I like to fold stuff and not hang so much. Um, this is just a brown t-shirt. This will also, I feel like mine will be quicker, because I'm sure you can see, my clothes are folded really nice, because I like Good them that way. you, brag and brag. <laughs> Um, but yeah. Okay, on the first row, this is hard. Stay still. I think I'm gonna get rid of my Tessa Violet shirt. Yeah? I do really like her, but like, it was, it's a 2X, because that's the biggest that they had, and it's too tight on me. And it's really cute. Yeah, get it out of there. It's not comfortable. No, that's okay. It's not serving you. I also, hey, this is a, a moment of silence. Phoebe hates this shirt. What shirt? It's my Alt-J Tour shirt. No, I love that shirt. <laughs> you hate this shirt. I do think it's funny because it is ugly. It is. I, I've only seen Alt-J in concert once. They're one of my favorite bands, which is funny because I always make fun of people who listen to music where I can't understand the words they're saying. And I think we all know that no one can understand the words that they're saying in any Alt-J song. But I loved this concert, but it doesn't fit me. Secondly, the person that I went to the concert with, we are enemies, I think. He's, <laughs> <laughs> he's definitely like stressful on a good day and I would say abusive on a bad day. Um, the head. So like, there's no reason for me to keep this. It also has a stain, not a horrible one, but it also has like pit stain, not stains, but like, you know what I mean? When you've had a white shirt for a long time. So it, it can get done with it. But I am really sad about it. The last like eight closet clean outs, it made the cut because I like it so much. Okay, this t-shirt, long sleeve t-shirt. It's also technically too small for me, but I love it so much. And I do wear it when it's cold outside. And I love it. And I this artist still sells this shirt, so I think I could probably just buy it in a bigger size. But I don't know. I love it the way it is. I don't mind the way it fits. And I also love the shining. So why would I get rid of it? I love it so much. Okay, now it doesn't want to fold good, though. Fold good, please. I'm begging you. All right. Okay, this is a shirt I got at the clothing swap, um, and I actually didn't know what it was. I thought it was like a gift that someone gave out at their wedding, <laughs> which, which I thought was hilarious. And after wearing it on stream, it's apparently two characters from the film The Mummy, <laughs> which I haven't seen. So I am going to take it back to the clothing swap <laughs> so that someone who has seen The Mummy can appreciate it. Um, but I thought it was, I thought it was, I was like, what a cute wedding gift. It's not that. This is a t-shirt I got in Texas at a bookstore. And it is really cute, but I don't wear it. Really? I feel like you wore that one a lot for a hot minute. I did. I did. I wore it a lot last summer. I wore it on like near my birthday last year. But... It's just, I don't wear it anymore. And I think someone at the clothing swap will be like, what a weird shirt. Oh yeah, they'll be stoked. Okay, I now have three booby bikini woman shirts. And I'm not ready to deal with it just yet, but I just know there's no reason for me to have three. So I'm just gonna put those up. I'm keeping this Mickey 50th anniversary shirt. Sorry, is it bad quality? Yes, I don't care. I love Mickey. I love that Disney World turned 50. 
this is just a boring shirt which I have to keep some of those for ads because we're not allowed to wear things that have like fun things on them which is annoying but whatever I'm definitely keeping my cruise line shirt Ugh. I have to keep my Epcot shirt here's the problem when you work at Disney World you collect too many fun shirts yeah and now it's a crime Ugh. this is so hard you're being really brave thank you I think I'm going to get rid of my softball team Risa shirt. Yeah? <sighs> yeah. I don't really wear three-quarter length shirts. No, that's true. You know what I mean? And I think someone at the swap will be like, this is so fun. You're not going to want it when it's cold out? I don't think so. Okay. I support you. When it's cold out, I put on a jacket. You know what I mean? No, that's true. That's I think true. I'm also going to get rid of my Sarah Day shirt. I know. Well, number one, we get ours confused all the time. That's true. Number two, I'm pretty sure it's only a 2X. Yeah. And so it's not super comfortable. And someone at the swap will be, like, really excited about it. Yeah. Um, so think about the swap. I have to keep my Skeleton Boy shirt. And I just bought this shirt at Target Pride before it was stressful. It's also a cute shirt. It is a really cute shirt. Gotta keep my Robert Pattinson Batman. Uh, I have so many shirts. <laughs> I love World's Best Worry Worrier. Yeah, you wear that one constantly. I know, but the problem is that I, I wear it too much, I think. Why? How? I don't know. I also wear this Elton John shirt a lot. And it's really faded. It's good. I'm going to take it to the swap. The Elton John one? Yeah. This one's not from his concert. Someone made this on Etsy. I was going to say, the one where his face looks so silly on your boobies? Yeah. I have to keep my curriculum shirt. And I have to keep my weird mother shirt. You keep saying you have to like it's a rule. Well, no. I really like them. Yeah, they're good. I also wear thank you for existing all the time. Yeah. I think the problem is I like all of these shirts, but I, I've in my, I'm in my loving t-shirt era. And every now and then I stop wearing t-shirts completely. And that's okay. And I'm worried that that'll happen soon. If it does, that's when we start donating them to the swap and it's not a big deal. I guess that's true. I think you kept your booby woman shirt from our last cruise. Yes. So I'm going to keep this one. And then this one that we thrifted, I am going to take to the swap because I think someone will be really into it. But it's so funny. It's so funny. It's so funny. It has such weird sleeves. It's clearly meant to be a beach cover up, and I love that. Yeah. Okay, I've got I've got a considerable amount of room here. I have too many shirts. Okay. You're being really brave. Thank you. I just made this one, so I'm keeping it for Disneyland. I'll just put them up here, I guess. I'm also gonna go through my sunglasses. Because I have a lot of pairs of sunglasses. Okay, this shirt I don't wear. It was for a free label ad, and I love free label, but it's got, like, this open crossbody back thing. And, like, I don't want my back out. Somebody will, though. And That's it's really true. soft. It's barely been worn. We'll be excited at this one. Some will be very into it. Oh, this is just a green t-shirt that I got for something specific. Gotta keep... My Jake Wesley Rogers and my pink castle shirts. Those are a need. Those are a necessity. Okay, this shirt, I was like, summer's gonna be here and I'm gonna wear this all the time. And it's been summer and I, I don't go anywhere that I could wear this. I've never seen this. It's so fun. I got it at the swap in like December. It's unhinged. It's really cute. With my pink pants, I think it'd be really cute. Yeah, we're in Disneyland. No, I can have my tits out in Disneyland. Your tits aren't out. No, that's because I'm wearing a shirt underneath. Mm. Also, like, this is the kind of shirt you can't really wear a bra with. That's true, I guess. You know what I mean? Yeah. And I think because of that, I probably won't wear it. And I got it at the swap originally. 
So someone will be very excited about it. This shirt has not fit me in a long time. It's literally just a black tee that's like ribbed from Target. I had th this shirt in three colors for a while and I wore them with everything. Yeah. When Phoebe and I first met. But now not so much. This is just a layering turtleneck that I don't wear anymore. Um, same with this one. They're both like one X's, you know? And I just don't, I don't need them. This is my free label green two, two piece that I'm obsessed with. This is my universal standard two piece set that I'm obsessed with. This is my free label jumpsuit that I'm obsessed with. It's so cute. And then this is a white turtleneck that I layer with everything in the winter. This, I don't know what this is. Oh, this is a long sleeve that I don't feel like adds any warmth. It's really soft. Um, it's from Teggings, which like I have other things from them that I really like, um, but I just don't wear this. So I'm going to take it to the swap because I'm not like a, I'm not a long sleeve person unless I really have to be kind of ever. Um, I'm going to keep these long or sorry, these layering stuff. I guess still here, but like kind of on their own. Okay, do I wear this shirt? No. I can't get rid of it. Which one? My Epcot 2000 shirt. Oh, it's so good. Here's what happened. It's mine now, bitch. I cropped it too short. And now anytime I wear it, you can just see like the bottom part of my bra. And it's not, that's not. That's a little treat. It's not horrible. I could, now that I've done it on something else, I could cut out the design and put it on a different shirt. So I'm going to put this in like, I have a little project box over here in my closet. Of like fabrics. I'm going to eventually make a patchwork dress. And since we've been hemming stuff so that it'll be ready for Disneyland, I've actually got stuff to put in it right now. So this, okay. I don't know what Old Navy put in the water at their design team last year. I only have one complaint about this and it's that you have to wear it zipped all the way up because otherwise like the collar, it doesn't exist. So it just hits you in the face, but it's made out of like, I don't know, like almost like rain jacket I was material. Say, it's like a spandex was a rain jacket. It's so strange, but like it's perfect for like a cruise vacation or like a beach vacation. Like sand doesn't really stick to it. When it gets wet, it like dries really quickly. It's amazing. Um, I love it so much. I wear it a lot in the it's summer. It's impressive that you wear it so much because that's not a color that you like. No, that's how good it is. I actually hate the color of it. It was just, and you can't dye it. It's like a weird material. Um, I'm sure you'll recognize this. This is a two piece set that I wear literally all the time. Okay. I have too many pairs of pajamas also. <laughs> no, I love your little house dresses. No, that's not a pair of pajamas. Okay. I've only worn these like three times. Which ones? The strawberry ones. Oh, they're really cute. But yeah. They're really cute, but they are kind of see-through and I am a bitch who wears loud underwear. That's true. So I don't think they're for me, but you know, they are really cute. Okay. This set I bought. It wasn't gifted. Yes. I wore it like a lot last summer and I haven't worn it all this summer. The swap will love it. The swap will love it. It's a honey's blowtorch like pant and shirt set. And I love it. This is one of like three big shirts that I have. I keep meaning to make like a, a long Instagram post about this, but like I denied myself of big shirt for a couple of years now because I was like for it to be like big shirt, it would have to be like a 5X. Whereas like, you know, when I was younger, a big shirt was like a 2X and now like a 2X is too small for me. And so I, mean, I was there's like- There's nothing wrong with being 5X. No. It's just like, you know, it's one of those things. But you know what I mean? Like, well, and like you can buy a big shirt at 10X. You can buy like, uh, there is something different about wearing big shirt. And I was like, no, like, I don't think it'll look good on me. And I'm literally, I was wrong. Buy a big shirt, buy, like get the oversized look by, thrifting like not a lot because you should let people who actually wear 5x obviously buy them 
but I got one five X shirt at the Goodwill and I love it. Big shirt supremacy. Big shirt, tiny bottoms is for everyone. It is. Okay, this is another one I'm sad about. <sighs> Phoebe won't wear this. What is it? It's a two-piece velvet outfit. Two-piece velvet outfit? Yeah, I wore it on our honeymoon on the plane. You don't remember this? This is a button-down oh, shirt. One. Oh, yeah, it's so weird. And it, you look beautiful. It's so cute. It doesn't have pockets, though. I think if it did have pockets, I'm too lazy to add them. I do know how, but I won't do it. I think if it did have pockets, I would keep it, but it doesn't. So someone will be really excited about it and that will be great for them. Okay. I put this shirt in here. Perfect. Cute. Okay. Down we go. Hmm. I don't think you'll be able to see me on the ground. We'll see. Nice. All right, I'm going down. Oh <clears throat> okay. Do you need anything over here? No, I'm just on the ground now. She's brave. I know. Okay, here we go. This, I feel, will be maybe the hardest drawer. This is just all my pajamas. My jams. My gym jams. Your lady jams. <laughs> my lady jams. And my sweatpants. Okay. These are fun sweatpants. I'm obviously keeping them. This is bike short. I'm going to make that its own category. These are also sweatpants. I think the real question is how many pairs of sweatpants does one girly pop need? And we're about to find out. This, these are jammies I just got, I'm keeping them. This is also jammies I just got. Well, this is like big shirt jammies. This is house dress, which is its own category. This, what are you? This is a singlet. This is a singlet I don't wear because it doesn't have pockets. Pee, did you want this one? What? It's exactly like your other one. Except my size. It doesn't have pockets. The is one it, you were Is it 2X? Uh, I don't even know. You can try it on. Throw it at me. It's at least a 2X. It might be a 3X. This is a big shirt that I paint in sometimes. This is an exercise, another bike short, and then a like long onesie thing. This is another big shirt that I paint in. <laughs> okay, now do I wear this actually around our home? Not that much, cause it's see-through. Is it so beautiful I would never get rid of it? Oh Absolutely. God. Yes. That one's my favorite thing you own. This one is so silky and it's so cute. I don't reach for it that much, but it is like one of my cuter, sexier nightgowns. You I don't know. This is maybe. You've got space. I don't have that much space. These are my Christmas jammies, as you saw in Phoebe's, so we can't get rid of them. Um, this is just a yellow t-shirt. It should go up here. I'll do that in a minute. This is another big shirt. This is the one I just got that is another Nikki Lady long t-shirt dress. And these are my official paint clothes. However, they are also jammies <laughs> that I've had for a super long time. I'll keep them. And then this is another big shirt. Now Christmas jammies, they can stay in the back. Hmm, okay. I think we put the sweatpants in here. I've got another pair of sweatpants on the table behind you that you can't see. Oh, I also have another pair of jammies over there. <laughs> Maybe my lovely assistant will grab them. What am I grabbing? 
I'm I've not got, grabbing them, but we're good. I got jammies, the cabin jammies, and also the black sweatpants over there. Okay, that, this? Yeah, that pile. Okay. Do you want your skirt over here also? Yes. Okay. Okay. You've messed <gasps> up my camera. Oh, no. You look good, though. How can I help? These are real pants. You continue to look good. I don't know what you looked like before. These are sweatpants I'm getting rid of. Do you want them to be able to see the piles that you have? Yes. Okay. Then yeah, probably like there would be good. Nice. Okay. You're like in the center surrounded by piles. That's Perfect. Nice. Okay. These are my cabin jammies. They are really soft. Now, I pro they're also Christmas jammies. So they are also going in the back because they're long sleeve. Okay, here we've got two pairs of sweatpants. I got rid of one pair. Let's put the painting jammies, then this pair. <laughs> and I have the perfect amount of jammies. Thank you for asking. And then these three. Like that. We'll put the two dresses next to each other. How's that? Boom. Look at that. Okay, this is the workout stuff coming in hot. All right, now I do not need five big shirts with paint on them. I think I probably need, I'm keeping the lavender one. This one doesn't have paint on it. It's like for actually being like cute big shirt. And I'm gonna keep the two most obnoxious one for dyeing my hair pink. And I'll get rid of these two. Goodbye. Now where I will put them, that's another question. Hmm. Oh wait, I had room up here, right? What's in here? Oh yeah, okay, so let's put the exercise stuff up here actually. Up here with the two-piece outfits. They're kind of like a two-piece outfit in their own way. Turtlenecks can go back there. And then I have plenty of room for big shirts. Big shirt kingdom. Now you might be thinking, that was so fast. I can't believe we're done. There's actually another dresser. Let's get to that. Okay, can you move my camera? This is my second dresser. Over there, we did, the top one's my underwear and socks. Now, I probably will show you how organized it is, to be honest, because I keep it very organized, I'm very proud. Unlike some people. Yeah. <laughs> but it wouldn't be very interesting, because I, if I am wearing a pair of underwear, and at the end of that day, I'm like, I should get rid of these, I threw them away that day. So I keep my, I keep my underwear pretty gone through. Um, this is dresses, hats, sweaters that I don't wear that often so they're folded up, pants. This is a fake drawer. There is technically stuff in it. I'm going to take it all out. This drawer is broken. Um, I just painted it to look nice. I don't know how to fix a drawer. Um, right now, as you can see, it kind of wobbles. That's as much as I could fix it to go inside. So if I ever had a secret, I would hide it in there because it's almost impossible to open. Okay, well, of course it opened just now. Actually, I'm gonna leave it open so it doesn't get stuck. All right, I just got these pants. They're my new favorite pants right now. Keep. These, people always ask about, they're just Ava and Viv from like three seasons ago. I wear them all the time. These are my free label pants and I also love them. Okay, are these my ridiculous pants? Okay, listen, here's what happened. Have you guys seen how like some influencers who are really thin do that thing where they buy pants that are like too big for them and then they like kind of fold the button over so they have sideways crotch and then it became like kind of a trend for a little bit. So then they started making pants with sideways crotch on purpose. That's what these are. They are technically a little bit too big for me but I couldn't pass them up because they're ridiculous. I feel like also- Also nobody else took them. 
Like, no. Like, that's rather They were literally left at the end of a swap, both after the people that we gift stuff to on purpose went through, like, for them to sell at Fat Magic, um, and then also, like, at the end of the swap swap. Um, and I was like, I have to take these. They're ridiculous. They do technically fit. They probably fit better with, like, a belt. Um, like, I wouldn't stand up really fast in them but like sitting down they're super comfy they're also really well made they're eloquy i think they're gonna be hilarious when i'm like a little bit chunkier when i'm pregnant so i can't get rid of them but i will put them in the super secret drawer that i don't ever open these yellow pants are a staple i don't think i would ever get rid of them <sighs> okay here's the problem with these i love them they ride up so much to where it looks like I'm wearing like pants that aren't long enough for me. And I've worn them a lot. They have given me a lot of love. I think what I'm gonna do soon is just order like essentially a matching pair of Phoebe's bright pink pants, but in my size. Do it. These- Are these, these the red doll ones? Yeah. Yeah. I, it, the problem is the only reason I wear them so much is because they're so pink. It's not because they're very good pants. These are normal jeans, keeping. They're nice staple jeans to have. I don't wear these. If I still worked in an office job, I think I would wear these a lot. Um, they're literally just Target brand. I guess they are nice to have though when I have to dress nice. And I do really like them. They're like a brown, orangey color. But I don't have that much like auburn, like autumn stuff anymore. So I don't know like what I would wear on top with them. Actually, yeah, I guess I do. I think I would wear these with Halloween things and that's coming up. So I will keep them. These leather pants I bought for one event from a thrift store to be clear. Um, I don't think I'll ever wear them again. So I will donate those. And then I don't even know where these are from. These are universal standard. They're really nice jeans. They're just dark wash and I don't really wear dark wash ever. So I think I am gonna get rid of them. Nice. Okay. Let's, whoa. Let's pop these bad boys back in. Disney Wonder. It's too catchy. Now I've got my little pants. It's a little easier to get in there now. All right, let's go through. I actually went through these pretty recently, so that's why they're so few. I'm proud of myself. This is a staple summer dress. I wore it so much last summer. I haven't worn it at all this summer. Mostly because we haven't gone that many places though. Not so much because I don't like it. I still really like it. So I will be keeping it. Okay, I wore this on our last cruise. <sighs> Here's the problem. I think it's so cute. What is it? It's a little slip dress that's white. Oh, it's very cute. It's so cute, but I don't wear it. If you guys haven't noticed, there, I feel like there are two types of people with breasts. And there's the ones who never wear a bra, and there's the ones who always do. And I'm the one that always does. And I don't like having outfits that I can't wear bras in because I don't wear them. And so I think I am going to take it to the swap. I actually got this at the very first clothing swap we ever had. And then this is a turtleneck black dress. I never wear it. It's so soft because I literally haven't worn it since I got it. I wore it for an ad um, and that's it. So someone will have a beautiful, nice little turtleneck dress. Okay, here, this is gonna be harder. Nice. And then I can just put my keeps right back in here. With all this nasser. Disney Wonder. Um, okay. 
We'll start on this end. Uh, this is my Beetlejuice dress. It was the first dress I ever got from Honey's Blowtorch. And I do really like it. I think I'm gonna keep this one. Halloween is close, okay? It's practically almost Halloween, she said on July 17th. Now this dress is really cute. My problem with it is that we got it from Bloom Chic, who we now know is really stressful. And so I never wanna wear it because all it makes me do is think of like how stressful they are after we did an ad with them. Um, but it's a nice dress, but I won't wear it anymore. So I will donate it to the swap. I love this dress. Maybe I'll wear this to the wedding. I love it so much. It's so annoying, just like me. And I think it's perfect. Which one, the green one? No, the, is the green one's not annoying. What? This one. Oh, that I actually, wore to. I love that one. The green one that's the green and white mixed pattern floral. Oh one. yeah. This is another slip dress. And while it looks amazing with my little blue eyes, for the same reason, I'm not gonna keep it because I don't like having things that I can't wear a bra with because I don't like my girls all loosey goosey. This dress probably technically doesn't fit me. However, I will continue to wear it because the part it doesn't fit me at is my boobies and I usually wear it with a sweater on top. So it doesn't matter and I love it and I look like a cute little first grade teacher. This is another turtle neck dress that I don't ever wear. But I do think someone at the swap would really like it. That's a nice, that's like one of the best parts of the swap. <laughs> is it's, I don't know, it's really nice and easy to get rid of stuff when you know that like, more than likely at least someone will be, it'll either get taken home by someone that they really like for free, or it'll get donated to Smirk, which is where we donate all the stuff that doesn't get taken at the clothing swap. And they like help trans kids get like gender affirming clothing. So that's nice. This is another one that I feel like I wore, like I wore it once a week when we first moved to Oregon. Which one? The like first grade teacher tie up -y one. Oh yeah, it's so cute. It's so cute. I love it so much. You could bring it back out. I, w I don't know if it would fit me and I'm too sad to find out. That's fair. But I do have room to keep it, so I am just gonna keep it for now, but. It's not like I'm bursting at the seams now that I got rid of a bunch of t-shirts. This is a t-shirt dress that I personally don't have any big feelings about, but it's so comfortable. The green one? Yes. It's so cute on you. Vivi loves when I wear it, which it's is so, so funny because it's just a triangle t-shirt dress. It's adorable. But I do, it is really comfortable. <laughs> so I do really like it. And then this is my most like fun rainbowy honey's blowtorch, which I'll also keep. Nice, I have a whole empty dress drawer. That's crazy. All right, sweater drawer. I don't know if I'll get rid of any of these. Actually, this is just a turtleneck pink one. I do think I'll keep it. Well, no, here's the pros is that Hannah has almost a, like a very similar one. And so it's fun when she has hers because then we match. But the problem is that this one's a crop top, so literally the only thing I wear it with is one of the dresses that I was just talking about. But it is really nice to have when it's cold outside as an option. And I do have the room to keep it. Like I have plenty of room. So I guess there's no reason to get rid of it. Okay, I know that everyone else is tired of sweaters like this. I don't care. I didn't get to wear them when they were popular. So I love this stupid sweater. I think it's cute and I'm keeping it. And no one can convince me otherwise. This is just a pink sweater vest. I don't reach for it anymore. I am about to get really cute pants in the mail though that I think would look really cute with it. So I will keep it for now. And then um, Phoebe found this for me. And when they picked it up, I was like, I don't see your vision. And then as soon as we got it home that day, I was like, they were right. Cause I love it. <laughs> yeah, it's so cute on you. 
nice. And then my long sweaters, um, I either have folded over there or ha hanging in my closet. This is mostly sweater vests with the exception of that one sweater. Okay, let's go through my secret broken drawer. This is how I fixed it, by the way. This is this side. That's what it's supposed to look like. This is what I did to the other side. I was like, this will probably work. That's probably fine. I think I'm gonna use this for skirts and shorts. Well, no, because I have all of my shorts folded up over there now. So I guess I'll use it just for my two skirts. And maybe I'll expand my skirt collection. These pants I got at the swap, I wore them like a lot the weekend that I got them. And then I haven't worn them since. So I'm gonna take them back to the swap. These shorts, they're fun. I'm keeping them. I do like them. I don't know if I'll wear them that much, but I'll keep them here in skirt town because they're fun. This is another pair of shorts. I have, oh no, I only have one pair. Maybe I will keep my shorts over here because it turns out I have more pairs than I thought. Um, this is a globe. This is something that Kyle brought me in April that's supposed to be for Christmas, but I don't, I didn't want to go all the way down to our Christmas decorations to put it away. So now it's in the secret drawer, along with the pants that don't really fit me that will one day. I feel like normally when people say that, they're like, they're my goal weight pants and mine are, these will be so cute when I'm pregnant pants. <laughs> okay, the last one's hats, which I actually feel like, I, I don't know. I probably do have too many hats. I'm kind of back in a hat era though. That's true. You're wearing a lot of baseball caps. I am. I, here's the problem is I have like five bucket hats that I made when I was really in my bucket hat era and now I'm not so much. Now we could bring those to the swap. Oh, I probably will. Here's my strawberry beanie, I mean beret. Oh yeah, I forgot about my boob beanie. This is my boob beanie. I was trying to make a cute pun. This is my strawberry bucket hat. Somebody made this for me, which is really cute. See, when we had like still a following, but not as much, we both had day jobs still. So it's really cute. This is Phoebe's that they then gave to me and I haven't found an excuse to wear it yet because I think they gave it to me after Halloween last year but I do love it. I've got two pairs of Mickey ears that I made. I'm trying to decide if I want to bring my Tiana ones when we go to Disneyland. I do think they're so cute. But literally her area is like closed right now. I love this hat. I never fucking wear it. I have to take it to the swap, it's so fun. I'm obsessed with this one. I also love this Beetlejuice one. I got it on our honeymoon. I got it for our honeymoon, I guess I should say, because we went to Universal one day and I will never get rid of it. It's so stupid. It's reversible also, so the other side says strange and unusual, unusual with the sandworm. That's so silly. I love a reversible bucket hat. Are you kidding me? Okay, I'm keeping this one. I'm definitely keeping my Mardaluna one. I wear it probably the most. This is a scarf. This is my scarves area. Someone's gonna be watching this being like, this is the most boring video. <laughs> but I hope some people will like it. So these I don't ever reach for. These are fun. This is a weird little collar that I always forget that I have that um, Honey's Blowtorch sent me to add to an outfit. And then I just never do it because I always forget it exists. And then this is my favorite scarf and also my only scarf. Artist Colette made it. 
And it's like little fun little flowers. Colette Bernard. Colette Bernard. Yeah, but they're at as artist Colette. Oh, yeah, yeah. I just, people might know them actually. Amazing. Keep those there. I am going to push them to the back, though, because it's not really scarf season. Okay, I actually only have three baseball caps. That's actually way better than I thought. Um, Mickey ears are the kind of thing that I feel like, because we go to Disney World so much and Disneyland so much, there's no reason to get rid of them, especially the two that I made, because um, they're not made very well. <laughs> now, up front here, I think I'll put the beanies. And then these two. I don't know if I want to keep any of the bucket hats I made. I will keep this one. It's my favorite one. Is it the yellow one? Well, the yellow one with the flowers on the other side. Yes, it's so cute. It's really cute. I used to have a matching mask back when we were like making masks instead of uh, knowing that the like industrial ones are better. This is like my Animal Crossing looking one that I really liked, but I don't think I ever wore it like this. I normally wore it with the rainbow. And then this one, I think I thrifted this fabric and then Shelly had this fabric laying around. Maybe I will keep this one. No, I won't, I won't wear it. Okay. All right, I think that's it. We did a lot of work today, Peehee. Yeah. Phoebe has a lot more room in their closet. I have a lot more room in my dressers. We have a lot of stuff to take to the clothing swap next month. Yeah, I feel better. I love doing stuff like this. This is my favorite kind of stuff. I actually cleaned out our kitchen yesterday. I didn't film it because it was fun and exciting for me and I didn't want to be also working. You know, even though, like, this is also fun. You know what I mean. I love you. You're a weird girl. No, I'm normal. Um, but, yeah. If you like this kind of video, let us know. I try to do at least, like, one thing similar to this, like, a month. So I'll clean out, like, our kitchen or our coat closet or the craft closet. Um, I don't know if that will continue as we, like, eventually become parents because I know it's something that's very time-consuming. But I genuinely, like, am the kind of person who really likes to keep things organized, ideally. And the best way to keep clutter out is to, like, continuously go through your things. So, yeah. Okay, that's it. Okay, can you stop it? Yeah.